I'm Len Clark with Irish 101 for Saturday, January 19th, powered by Irish Illustrated. Become a subscriber today on the web at irishillustrated.com. A wild night of hockey action on Friday night in Madison, Wisconsin, between the 12th-ranked Irish and the Wisconsin Badgers. Notre Dame's Michael O'Leary scored at the 6:24 mark of the third period to give the Irish a 5-4 lead. And then with just over a minute remaining, Notre Dame scores on an empty net to get a 6-4 victory. Fighting Irish now 13-8-1 overall, and the two teams meet again Sunday at the United Center in Chicago. Notre Dame men's basketball is back home for a Saturday matinee ACC game against the 16th-ranked Wolfpack of North Carolina State. The Irish are 11-6 overall and 1-3 in ACC play. They tip it off this afternoon at 2 o'clock Eastern time. And Notre Dame wide receiver Chris Fink has announced he will return this fall for a fifth year of eligibility. This past season, Fink caught 49 passes for 571 yards and two touchdowns for the Irish. And it was 45 years ago today. Notre Dame 71, UCLA 70 with six seconds left. Into Walton, he can't score. Turn of it, Myers, Gilmate, it's all over. Perfect game, it's perfect game. And number one ranked UCLA Bruins have been upset by the Irish of Notre Dame. 71-70, the longest winning streak in collegiate sports history has ended where it began three years ago. That's your Notre Dame update, powered by Irish Illustrated. I'm Len Clark, and this is Irish 101.